the number six guy on my list is a uh, former NBA player, Jerry Lucas. Um, played during the 1960s uh, and into the 1970s. Um, Jerry Lucas never led the NBA in rebounding. Um, however, his career paralleled that of uh, both Will Chamberlain and Bill Russell. So that's the main reason why he never actually led the league in rebounding. Um, however, Lucas is the only man outside of both Wilt and Russell, as well as the only non-center, to average uh, at least 20 rebounds in a season. And uh, he accomplished this feat twice. In 829 games, uh, Lucas grabbed 12,942 boards. Uh, for his career, he averaged uh, 15.6 rebounds per game. Uh, the 15.6 rebounds per game is the fourth highest uh, average of all time. Even when you acknowledge that in, during his era, the game was played at a much faster pace, which would cause more possessions, uh, so you have more missed shots, and therefore rebounders will have more rebound opportunities. That's why a lot of these guys had these extremely high rebound uh, totals back in the 60s and into the 70s. Um, even with that considered, his uh, dominance in rebounding uh, was still uh, outside of Wilt and Bill Russell. Uh, the top in, in, uh, in the league, and he was the best rebounding power forward in the game uh, during his time. Uh, Jerry Lucas, number six on my list.